Hi, I'm Candace Miller, the Macomb County Public Works Commissioner, and I'm joined by Mark Hackel, our county executive, and Lauren is from uh, Consumers uh, Energy. And we're here because we have a great partnership. We're at the Sterling Relief Drain in Sterling Heights, which is an enormous drain that we have done a lot of work on, fortunately with a lot of government grants. And we're really here to celebrate Earth Day. And when I think about Earth Day, I think about all kinds of things, but one of them is clean, fresh, pure water. And what can we do to help Mother Nature do her job better, right? And so this Sterling Relief Drain is really a great example of what we can do. And so within the last couple of years, we have literally uh, planted thousands and thousands of trees, all kinds of various kinds of trees, of course, native to Michigan. Uh, and as well, in sort of what we call the invert of this drain, we have planted all kinds, we put plugs in of all kinds of different native plants to Michigan. And the reason that we've done this is because, again, we're trying to help Mother Nature. So we've opened up, we took out a lot of old metal culverts and sort of, we call it daylighting, but we're allowing Mother Nature, the ground, the earth, to absorb all kinds of various contaminants before they get out into our waterways. In this case, this drain goes into the Clinton River and of course, and ultimately right out into ma our magnificent Lake St. Clair. So we're taking out thousands of pounds of phosphorus and nitrogen and sedimentation, all of these kinds of things. And at the same time, we're also really trying to uh, create an environment, if you will, uh, for our critter friends. And uh, we've actually created about a two and a half mile long butterfly flyway here for all of our pollinator friends. So it really has been a tremendous success. We've gotten all kinds of uh, state awards, uh, local awards, state awards, and actually have just won a national award for this project. And so again, it's uh, a way for us here in Macomb County to think about the greening of Macomb County, the kinds of canopy that these trees uh, will provide for the next generation you know, many generations to come, and what we can all do working together. And uh, of course, we have great partnership with, uh, with our department and our county executive, but also with the private sector. So when you see Consumers Energy and you see all these volunteers out here, these are, uh, these are individuals that uh, live and work right in our community. And, uh, and so we work, we partner with them, and we all work together to do the very best job that we can to create a, uh, a great environment. And uh, for us, Earth Day is really every day. You know, you think, Mark? Yeah, I agree. And again, you know, Candace, <clears throat> I think you, you hit it head on. You look at these folks that are here, that are volunteering their time, you know, to plant trees and then obviously picking up the garbage that's in and around here. You think about Earth Day and again, natural beauty we have here in Macomb County. And I don't think anybody would doubt that. Macomb is pure Michigan. You look at the amenities and everything we had, it adds to that, if, I guess, if you will, uh, that mindset about what we have in our own backyard. And so getting people to want to be part of that and partnering with us to try to clean up our environment and uh, kind of pitch in to, to leave it the way it was or maybe restore it to the way it uh, once was and should be. So again, the efforts on behalf of Public Works, what they do, we think about just the drains and the underground. Well, there's more that goes into this and planting these trees along these drains is that, that natural way of uh, bringing back the environment. So, you know, I'm excited every time they talk about Earth Day or even Arbor Day, which is coming upon us as well, come to the realization that people do care about what's going on. You know, after this past couple of years, you come to realize we have become more connected with nature and I think we've become more appreciative of it because we all have one thing in common, no matter who you are, we all have one thing that is incredibly in common. And, uh, and I think we all realize that. We all live in the same place. It's called Earth. And so with that, we need to make sure we're taking care of the Earth. And again, I couldn't appreciate more of the support we're getting from various organizations, specifically uh, Consumers Energy, for what they've been doing. So Lauren, thank you for your, your efforts as well. Yes, and thank you. I want to say we appreciate the partnership. We're so excited to be here with Macomb County and be part of Earth Day and celebrating this special day. I think, Candace, you nailed it on the head, stating that you know, we wish Earth Day was every day, and that's truly how we view it, and it just really wouldn't be possible without great partnerships with Macomb County and these great volunteers out here working and planting trees and cleaning up, you know, our Mother Earth, and we're just proud to be here today with all of you. Thank you. Thanks so much for joining us, and remember, every day is Earth Day. <laughs> <laughs>